Hey everybody, I'm pretty excited uh, because I'm going to be playing Super Mario Bros. 3. Uh, so as you can see here, I am playing it on, I'm playing the Wii version of it on my Wii U. Uh, yeah, I can only get, I can only get my game capture to work properly with HDMI systems. Uh, I was wanting to, I was really hoping to do this on an actual Super Nintendo, but uh, luckily I remembered that I have the Wii version. And interesting thing about it is uh, this is pretty much pretty much my first time playing it. Uh, I put the game in earlier just to make sure that it works and whatnot, but uh, I was actually pretty surprised to find that it's the exact same game. As you can see right here, here it starts. Eventually. Yeah. Alright, so... Without further ado, let's just get into this. So yeah, Super Mario Bros. 3. I could very easily play any one of these, but... 3 is definitely my favorite. So, of course, that's what I'm going to stick with. Alright, so let's see here. Uh, let's do D, because D is a great letter. New! Oh, lovely. Alright, this was my experience with the original Super Mario Bros. games when I was younger was playing them on the Super Nintendo, Super Mario All-Stars. I never had an NES as a kid. Uh, I was born in 89. Uh, by that time, the Genesis was already out, basically, and that was my very first game system. So, without further ado, uh, let's go to one player. Alright, I'm really excited. I hope, I'm really hoping that I can just get this in in one game. Or one, one go. I don't really want this to go too long. But, I'm going to be having some fun. I'm not going to be speed running. Uh, just so you know, this isn't speed run, obviously. This isn't 100%. I am just... Well, I mean, for in layman's terms, I am doing the least amount... Or, what am I trying to say? I'm going to do basically the very least to actually get to the final Bowser and beat him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shit. Okay, well, that was... that worked out. Damn it. Yeah, as you can see, I'm great at this game. Oh, you respawn fast. Start! Alright. I don't want to jinx myself or anything, but I'm almost positive I could do this. No game overs. And just so you know, well, I mean, I totally can skip level 3 and 4 of this world. But I might do, like, one of them, maybe, number 3. Oh, you know what? I'm dumb. Can I still get up there? Yeah. So, that being said, I am going to try and build up as many lives as possible. I am pretty darn good at... Pretty darn good at accumulating stars at the end. Should always be an easy five lives. Give me that star. Man, I've been playing so much Mario Maker these past couple of years. <laughs> it's similar, it's just not quite the same thing. All right, so that is level two done. You know what? Let's do let's do level three. Hey, you know what? Actually, just for fun, I'm not gonna use them, but I'm gonna get the warp whistles. Just because I know where most of them are. But I'm just gonna show you I can get them, but I'm not gonna use them. Wang. La da da. La da ba 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 do wa ba do wa la do do la do do la da da da. Very heavenly music. Very fitting. Of course, I think it would be even more badass to play this on a real NES. Um, I don't have good luck with NES. Unfortunately, I have two NES systems 
and neither of them work. I've tried everything. I mean, I've even considered getting them professionally fixed. Maybe one day. To tell you the truth, I really would just love to get myself an NES top loader. Probably be my next big system purchase. And bypass number four. I'm gonna do the bonus, why not? Maybe get some lives out of it. Ugh. What an abomination. Alright, castle time. And also second warp whistle time. Fun. Yeah, I don't know if you've, uh... If you've never played this game before, or you don't know where the whistles are. Oh, why did I get that? Well, you know, another, another Tanuki Leaf will be around soon. There it is. I just need to take you out. And we'll go for a fly. I hope you all can hear that controller well. There we are. Yeah, so there's warp whistle number two. And, uh... Let's see. Hopefully, once I beat this level, I can get myself five more lives. Now, I'm known to... I'm known to accumulate quite a few lives while beating this game. Oh, it doesn't bring the shell. Okay, actually, I never knew that. Never tried it. It's all that damn Mario Maker I've been playing lately. Just take a shell everywhere. Take a spring everywhere. You gotta do... Anything you can in the game. Try and weed out the hot garbage. Actually, I'll probably do some more Mario Maker videos. That's a fun game. It's always worth recording as well. Yay! And up we go. Alright, five lives. Nice. Alright, so up to 11 now. Uh, we'll see how many I get. And of course, if anybody is curious, yes, of course, I am playing this. Uh, it's the Wii version. I am playing this on my Wii U. Thank you, HDMI. And uh, I'm using <laughs> the special GoldenEye Gold Classic Controller. I love this thing. I want to thank my brother once again for giving that to me, as well as the GoldenEye game for the Wii. Still actually haven't even played it. Probably should. I've actually got quite a few games in my collection that I've never played. I just kind of, I just wanted them. But that's just how it goes sometimes. In this case, my brother didn't want his Wii anymore. So, gave them to me. Figure it's a bit of a better home for him. I'm sure he could have just as easily sold them. But, uh, well, anyway, thanks again, bro. Alright, time to take you on. I got a Tanuki, I'm not worried. There you are. There you are. I got a star. Nice. Oh, I don't know. I'm kind of thinking this might have to be done in two videos at least. Alright, these videos, they always... I always intend on them being like half hour to an hour long, and they're never that long. Of course, if it were a speedrun of this game, it'd probably be done in like 10 15 minutes. Maybe I could try a toad voice. I'll try a toad, a toid, a toid voice later. Emulate that toid. Oh, the classic airship. Classic controllers are actually pretty loud controllers in terms of buttons. But that's not necessarily a bad thing. If you're like me, and if you're like many other people who watch gameplay videos, I'm sure you love the sound of controllers. I know I do. Okay, that should be easy. Boom. 
Boom. And boom. You know, I say this now, this is only World 1, but lately a lot of people have been talking about this game, saying that it's very hard. Um, I, I find this game to be actually rather easy, uh, but that could be just because I play... I played this game quite a bit, so I'm more than familiar with it. Um, but, uh, I don't know. There's always noobs, right? <laughs> oh, thank heavens. I'm back to my old self again. Thank you so much. Here's a letter from the princess. Greetings, if you see... Oh, okay, I'm not, not going to do that. Let's just get right on to world two. Uh, world two, level one. Oh, the hopping blocks. Yeah. Love this one. So I do want you. Okay. And I'll hop off of you. Well, fucked it up. Star! Hey, the star in this game is not very long. I'm just gonna jump over everything except for that. Bounce off of you. No! Darn it. Okay, well, can I get a star, please? Duh. Whatever. I don't know, sometimes getting that full P speed is a tricky. Um. Sure, let's just do this real quick. Get some items out of it. <laughs> Mario's so tiny in these. Pretty sure it's the same thing. I have the oh hey, I have the strategy guide for the uh, Super Mario Advance 4, Super Mario Brothers 3 for Game Boy Advance, and uh, it actually has maps drawn out of every possible solution or solution. Mm. Come on, we gotta go fast. Oh yeah, this is a... Yeah, this is one of the coin ship levels. As you can see, I'm doing great. I mean, most of these levels don't really take too much time. Uh, I guess it doesn't really matter, but I'll take the free one up. Sure, why not? Yeah, I was surprised to find that this is basically the exact same game as the Super Nintendo version. It's pretty much like a uh, an emulation. I was expecting there to be like some extra features. I mean, not that I'm disappointed necessarily. I'm actually glad that I get to be recording this for you guys. Uh, no, without any complications and whatnot. Of course, if I had a different capture device, it would be different. But I've got the Elgato Game Capture HD, which supports composite video, but the pass-through is not always... the pass-through does not always work, especially not on cartridge-based games. Earlier today I tried hooking up my PS1 to it, and uh, it wouldn't pick up everything. It was very strange. It wouldn't pick up any like full-motion video. Uh, it wouldn't do... and it wouldn't do like some gameplay. Uh, just as a just as a trial run, I tried to record the game Driver. You guys remember that game? I was trying to do that, and uh, yeah, of course it wouldn't. It started recording at the PlayStation intro screen. Did that just fine. When it got to the full motion video at the beginning, it stopped recording, and it just wouldn't even pass through at all. And then. Uh, then it did the menus just fine, and then there was a bit of a bit of a thing going on between the loading and the gameplay. Uh, basically, yeah, it's really complicated, but I just really do not 
I'm not super well equipped for doing stuff like that, although I really would like to, because old games are my favorites, and those are the ones that I enjoy playing the most. Granted, there are plenty of new games that are awesome. Uh, I mean, especially for, especially for like, Wii U and Switch, and, uh, yeah, they're just a little bit more in-depth, that's the only thing. Uh, so let's see here, let's do the, is this the Angry Sun? Yes, it is. I didn't think it had been that long since I'd played this game. Leap! Okay, let's see, let's hope I don't fuck this up. I do want to take my time here. Those Koopas really fuck with me. Oh yes, and by the way, my language will not necessarily be family friendly. I should have warned you from the beginning, but it's all for comedic effect, so lighten up. Uh, oh man, I wanted to take on one of the boomerang guys. Oh, is this the one I want to do? Yes, it is. Yeah, so I'll just basically play whatever levels I want. And like, say this one, this one's just really easy to blow through. What are you? Just a coin? Oh, but I know what you are! I really need to stop dying. Oh, there we go, I get to take you on. Okay, throw your boom. Am I really just this bad? Die. Oh, music box, that'll come in handy. <laughs> yeah, of course I said earlier. Yeah, you just breeze right through. And I got got maimed trying to find a secret. But I will get that secret, by golly. switch time. Wait. Oh no! It's right there. Ugh. Fine, I'll just take these coins and I'll be on my way. Oh! <laughs> of course. Well, then I'll get a few more coins. How about that? Come on, can I please get all of them? Oh, I got a life. One more. Yay. Crowd goes nuts. Uh, yep, it's a new key. I'm fine. There's another five lives for me. Shoot, I mean, you're pretty much guaranteed that star as long as you can be at P speed, and as long as you, as long as you get that lower left corner. Uh, sure. And those are just racking up, aren't they? Uh, sh God damn, I knew that. Yeah. Really do need to start using these a bit more. One up. Could I have a one up? Where is it? I'm just gonna YOLO. Oh, that was dumb. Oh, the things I would do if I had a hammer. Pyramid maze time, I guess. <laughs> oh boy, this is probably going to go into two videos. Stinking buzzy beetles. Oh, 
Sorry, I kind of had to think there for a second. Fuzzy Beetles, get out of here. Okay. Now it's time to find out what the king needs. I'm pretty sure I already know. Oh, it's terrible. <laughs> Actually, I'll tell you what was terrible. Was that toad impression? Uh, okay, yeah, we'll find the magic wand. We'll find the magic wand. Some people I know can do the toad impression pretty darn well. Fireflower would be awesome, but it's not necessary. A sip of what's left of my coffee. Oh boy. Okay, looking at my computer, 22 minutes already. Well, I guess we can average just a little over 11 minutes per world. water levels. I've never really hated them that much, but just always preferred others. Actually, while we're on this topic, is anybody out there who plays Mario Maker? <laughs> How many underwater Super Mario Bros. 3 courses have you ever came across? To me, oh, whoops. Oh, that guy always gets me. To me, it seems like that is easily the least used theme in the entire game. Anytime I see it, it just looks strange. In Mario Maker, that is. Uh, do I dare go down here? Maybe I do. Okay, what? Yes, one up. Of course I dare. Get some coins, too. Nice. And... Oh, you... One that just waits, plots and plans. There we go. Okay, well that time, I guess it was kind of the corner. It was more the side, but basically you just need to get it as quickly as possible. If you want to get that star guaranteed. Whoa. Okay, I never knew about that. In all the years I played, uh, okay, I shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done it. Mm, nah, I'm good. I'm trying to remember. I'm pretty sure there's a third warp whistle. Just can't quite recall where it is.
Uh oh. Oh, excuse me a second. Excitement, I forgot to plug my computer in. So, now we're good. Frog suit, okay. I do know one level here in the future that pretty much needs that. level. I probably should have hit the P, that would have been a bit easier, but hindsight's always 2020, am I right? No! Gotta live! I want to live! What's the name of that fish? Big Bertha. Give me a star. There we go. Because I'm a star player. Dude, man, I'm just... These are popping up left and right. I don't quite know if I even really want to do these. Oh, one up. Uh, you were right there? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, my, my voice is... Perfect. Nope. Star and star? Okay. Flower... Yeah, I'm smart. I pick up on things really easily, if you didn't already tell. Uh, water... Water Brothers. Water Brothers! Whoa, 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 whoa! Seemed really floaty for some reason. Yeah, just get lost. To have fun storming the castle! Is this the one I think it is? Oh, is it the sixth door? One, two, three. Booze, go away. Four, five, six. I know about the little trick in this one, but I'm not good enough to do that. Let's take on this guy. Should be a pushover. Haha. <laughs> oh, I did always feel those boss battles were pretty easy. When they start putting more blocks in place, it gets a bit trickier, but other than that, uh, let's go to four, because it's on land. Oh, is a Lakitu coming? Yeah, yeah, no, yes. Lakitu. Weren't you brainwashed or something? Aren't you normally a good character, but Bowser did something to you? I mean, obviously you at least do some good because you film Mario the entire time you're playing Super Mario 64. See why he would do that, unless maybe Bowser wants to keep a closer eye on him. But if that's the case, it wasn't doing very well because Mario's definitely defeated Bowser three times at least in that game. Uh, let's go right to World Six. Auto scroll. Is that a Tanuki? Nope. Flower, even better. I knew that was coming. You know what? Screw that thing. 
We're going down here, though. Well, I could have done it. I could have done the thing with the with the dude, but never mind. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Some coins. Ooh. Toying with fate there. And there's another five lives. Awesome. Shit. Already at 30 almost 33 minutes and I don't get to go to world 8 or level 8 come on mm, not a big fan of this level those guys can kiss my ass I guess it is just the left side then. That was definitely the side. And I'm gonna go straight to world eight. Maybe I can beat it in one go, that would be great. I just remember numerous times just getting right ahead to eight, die, and you gotta go try seven or some other level. Then you can just get right back into it. Come on, go faster, go faster. Yay, now I, uh, I guess now I get to try the castle. about to say, oh, it's Bowser time. What's this dude's name? I have no idea. It's not one of the Koopa Kids. I mean, Koopa Kids are what you face at the airship. I'm not dumb. I don't know what that guy's name is. You know, no thanks for right now. Four twenty, blaze it. That's what I get for blazing it. Mm -hmm. Gotta try blazing it again. Yeah. 
You will not feast on me. Uh, do I want to go? I'm gonna go up. Yeah, would have been just that easy. Yeah, some of these levels seem like they take no time at all. Or maybe they're just so fun that time is flying. Okay. <laughs> Would you please hold the goddamn hammering? in Mario Maker, 1-ups actually do kind of matter in this game. Let's see, it's under here, over there, and through there. One fell swoop. And another fell swoop gives me five lives. You know, that, that is the secret to this game, if you ask me. You get a bunch of lives, and you're pretty much set. Uh, you take a look at, like, the original Super Mario Brothers, Super Mario Brothers 2. Lives aren't as easy to come by. Oh, hey, there's Japan, by the way, in case you guys did not know. And this castle is pretty much Tokyo. The location of Tokyo, more or Tokyo, or... No, I'm probably wrong there. Somebody correct me, please. In fact, yeah. Correct me. Oh, it's terrible. The king has been transformed. Please find the magic wand so we can change him back. And yes, by the way, Toad is a... Toad is British. And he also has a very soft voice like this. Because he's small, he's diminutive in nature. choice. Well, let's do it. Yes. Nice. You are, and you are. Yes. Where are you? 20. Uh, 20? Okay. 10 and 10. Alright. Domination. Domination. Alright, now let's get back to that airship. Damn airship. And fucking Wendy. Uh, I probably should have used one of the bonus items that I just got. But, never mind. Just take out a few of these moles. Plop. Get you out for that bull. That bull. Yeah, you better watch out for that bullet bill. He'll come snipe you. Right when you least expect it. Like there. Damn it, man. Give me that, please. Oh, hello, neighbor. No. 
now. Give me a fire flower, that'll do. But I mean, as I'm as I'm sure you guys have picked up by now, I am an expert at this game. Nobody can touch my expert skills. Nobody can touch my expert skills. Nobody wants to touch my expert skills. There we go. We. How tedious. I'm not gonna do it. Not even necessary. I don't think that's necessary at all in this game. Let me come across one of those things. Uh, no, let's go beneath. Come on, bud. Wendy! Yeah, you make your first move. And then you make your second move. And then finally, just make your third move. And call it good. There we go. Excuse me a moment. My remote control. Okay, so we're getting into World 4. Um, and I see on the timer we just passed 43 minutes. I'm going to have to call it good after World 4, unfortunately. Uh, these games take longer to beat than I remember. But anyway, sorry. After all that coffee, uh, I had to make the uh, call to nature, if you know what I mean. And I'm sure you do. Uh, so now we're in Big World. I like this world. Great idea. I like, uh, what is it? World 7? It's got the one level. It's got the one level where you can alternate between big and small. I like that one as well. I've also seen a couple of Mario Maker levels take advantage of that same kind of thing. I think that's just a... Another great example of... You know, I mean... What am I trying to say here? They give you a lot of things to work with in the game, not everything, but yet just to see what people have actually come up with, it's amazing. You know, I think it's the, uh, it's kind of the def, it, I mean it is like, you know, life gives you lemons, you make lemonade. Flower? Come on. Um, not necessarily saying that uh, Nintendo's given us lemons by any means. But, yeah, we do what we can with what we have. You can't break the gamer's spirit. Hi there. Ooh. Okay, I'll take some of these coins here, and I'll take that star while we're at it. I guess now it really doesn't matter what I get. I'm always gonna go for the star, though. Actually, if I could get a flower, star, mushroom, that'd be great. Uh, no thank you. I used to think that, uh, I used to think that you should get some sort of bonus if you get one of each. Dude. Oh, okay. 
I hear something good. Flargan style. Thank you. Uh, oh yeah, these blocks. Coffee's gone. Now time for Big Castle. Which really isn't big at all. No, yeah, but it's got those little flames. Oh no, that was stupid. Mm, yeah, that was very stupid. Leap. Well, that was close. Just the fire equivalent of a boo. I'll take that. I'm only now remembering that the thwomps in this game have that little, like, ring on the top. That big, 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 big water. It's awfully big, 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 big water. Give anybody bonus points if they can tell me exactly what that's from. about anything you guys are going to complain about. I've already predicted. But by all means. Okay, well, this is we're almost done with the uh, little four. Which means we're almost done with this video. I know, I'm sorry. I don't know, I just don't want, I just don't want these to go on too long. Don't want to bore you guys, necessarily. Don't want to make you sit through too much. Oh, -hoo. Don't want to make you sit through too much, but, uh... Also, it's really more about... Ah, excuse me. It's really more about, um, my own upload times and everything like that. Uh, last time I made a video that was almost an hour, it took... Yeah, about took practically 11 hours to upload. Oh, hey, it's Nuki. It's Nuki suit. Come here. There we go. I don't think I ever knew about that, to be honest.
dude. Yeah. It's castle time, my friends. Once again, I'm used to Mario Maker. And I think... Well... No, no, not necessarily. Never mind. But yeah, I'm used to Mario Maker. Where these are not solid. And then I'm sure if I go back to playing Mario Maker, it'll just be like the same thing. I just not know what that is for. Let's call it both, shall we? I don't... I don't necessarily appreciate being called dumb, but... I know realistically, in many aspects, I am. And I think, uh, to some extent, we all are. That's right, I called you dumb. <laughs> Loser. No, I'm just kidding. Shoot, if you've made it this far, thanks very much. Uh, it does mean a lot to me. And of course, of course we got the super, super slow one. edges for these auto-scrollers are a bit strange. Like, you can see... Well, that's a bad example. I don't want to die. I am as far right as I can go, and yet there's still, like, a, a block and a half space. Uh, same goes for the back as well. Ooh! You want to play with fire, little boy? No, 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 no. Let me get that, please. Thank you. Oh, this one is so slow. No jinx. Can we do this in one fell swoop? No jinx. We did it in one fell swoop. Okay. Turn back to a human. Whatever else. Uh, escape to the east. That's right. Oh, that is right. Okay, okay. I do know that one. Alright, so we're at World 5. Um, I will pick this up next time. Um, either way, thank you very much for watching. We will see you again in part 2.